Okay. I have been tasked with defending the undefendable President Donald Trump. But although he is a terrible man and a worse president, he might just be the president America and indeed the world needed right now. Firstly, it's important to note that Trump was not an unknown quantity. Everybody knew what he was about and voted him in anyway. Therefore, I can defend Trump by saying that he never hid himself from the public. And so if he was made president, that was the fault of the people, not the man. His history of bad financial decisions, including twice filing for bankruptcy, his treatment of people during his time running The Apprentice, sound grabs and evidence from prostitutes proving his status as a sexual predator, all of this was made known before he was voted into office. Trump has never hidden his incompetence from the world. I mean, how could he? So it's not his fault he's president, it's the fault of the American people, and maybe the Russians. Secondly, we need to look at the good he's done for the world by being so completely awful. The hashtag MeToo movement was born from the realisation that with him in power, women's rights were going to suffer. In response, the people took to the streets and to social media and we have arguably raised the awareness of women's rights to its highest point ever. All because America voted in a president who treated women like dirt. Similarly, his abuses of power and his inability to string a sentence together have drawn the world's attention to the flaws in the electoral system in America and in the world. Leadership in the world powers has been very right-wing over the last four or five years. But Trump's transparency in his dealings with race, disability and other countries have led to a swing, if not to the left, at least to a more central position. Even traditionally right-wing voters are tired of tweets in all capitals and are looking for a more moderate response to the major issues in the world. Finally, there is the comedic potential of having an inept president on the world stage. Alec Baldwin has made a career over the last five years of playing the man, sometimes being more convincing than the president himself. There's a cartoon show about him, and he has been referenced frequently in every panel show in the world over the past five years. So much so that most comedians are shouting that this might be too much of a good thing. But I say, keep going. We could fix social media, solve the mistreatment of women, and end race hatred in all in one fell swoop. Praise the glorious mess that is Trump. He is the caricature of insanity the world needed to hold a mirror up to the lunacy of the bad decisions that we make. We will learn from his stupidity, and surely that means that his time as president is worth celebrating. Thank you.